Hello and welcome ladies and gentlemen. In this video, I am going to show you that implementing phone number verification is actually not hard, and that you can do it in just a few lines of code. All the code that I'll be using is readily available in the GitHub repository linked in the description. We will be upgrading this basic registration form by adding a screen where we will prompt the user to enter the code that he received in an SMS. On the back end, we'll add an endpoint for sending phone numbers for verification and modify the register endpoint to include the verification code. Without further ado, let's take a look at the initial code. On the backend side of our application, we have this Express app with one endpoint that you can send HTTP POST requests to, which just stores the user in the local JavaScript dictionary. On the front end, we have a registration form that sends a request to that endpoint, and if the registration is successful, it just navigates to dashboard using React Native Navigation. If there's anything you're unsure about or you'd like a deeper explanation, feel free to ask in the comments section. The first step is to create a new screen and add it to the React Router Stack Navigator. We'll start by creating a new file called Verification Form JS. This will be our screen. We'll take the layout of the registration form and give it a little tweak. Now let's add the new screen to the Stack Navigator in App.js. Next, we'll create a logic for communication with the server. In the registration form, we'll pass all the form data to the Verify screen, and instead of sending a POST request to the register endpoint, we'll use the Verify endpoint, which we will be creating in a second, and send just the phone number. On the Verify screen, we'll send a register request with all the form data, including the code. And with that, the mobile app is done, let's switch to the server. First things first, we'll need to register with TextFlow and get an API key which you can use to send two free SMS messages. To do this, follow the link in the description. The registration process is simple, just sign in with Google. Once we have our account set up, we'll store the free API key for later use. Next, we'll create the Verify endpoint where we'll send a verification SMS. To send the Verify code and check if the code entered by the user is valid, we'll need to install the TextFlow JS node package, which can be downloaded using NPM. With the package installed, we'll add the new Verify endpoint and implement it. Firstly, we need to initialize the TextFlow library with the API key that we have stored a moment ago. Next, we will simply call the verify function provided in the TextFlow package, which sends the code to the provided phone number. We need to await the response of the verify function, so our verify handler should be asynchronous. Finally, we'll modify the register endpoint to accept the code, check if it's valid, and proceed only if it is. And that is all, let's see if it works. I am first going to try with the invalid code. Okay, now I will enter the valid code. Great, it is working. And that's all for today's tutorial. If you have any questions or suggestions for the future videos, don't hesitate to let me know in the comments. Until next time, see you.